Hey everyone. Hey, it's been a while, hasn't it? Um, I've been sort of in a reading slump lately and I've been hearing a lot of people talking that way for the month of March. Um, the weather got really, really nice here um, in northern Ohio. During the month of March we had like three weeks of just absolutely beautiful like May and June type weather and I don't know it just put me into a mood of like going outside and and um, stuff like that I who knows but anyway um, I thought I would check in and uh, let you guys know that I'm still alive and I wanted to announce um, that I'm going to try this year to um, be a part of the Dewey's Readathon, which is a 24 hour readathon sponsored at uh, 24hourreadathon.com, and I will put that link down in the um, comment or the in the description box. So, um, if anybody's interested in joining us, looks like right now there are 100, 200, 201 people signed up uh, to participate. In it. it is going to be Saturday, April 21st, um, and it would start at 8 a.m. Eastern Time. I'm not sure I'll be able to stay awake through the whole thing, but they have like different bloggers who are called cheerleaders, and I suppose you go there when you're feeling tired um, and you know, read something about what's going on in their blog. Um, so I don't know, I think it'll be, it'll be kind of fun. And I haven't picked out all the books I'm going to read yet. I probably will read uh, not like an entire book through the 24 hours. Probably depends on how it holds my interest. But um, as I'm starting to get tired, I might change books um, to, you know, try to stay awake <laughs> in formats because I have the e-reader and I have physical books. So, um, yeah, I'll put the link down below. So, so, the other things, I, I had three books here I wanted to mention. Um, I got this book recently um, called December by Phil Rickman. Now, I'm not a real big fan of horror, and uh, she mentioned this book. Uh, this is Holly uh, from Bookgasmic Channel. Sorry about that. She, this, she mentioned that this is her favorite book of all time. So I went ahead and found a used copy of it. I'm not sure if it's in print anymore or not. It probably is in, in the mass market paperback. But um, I wanted to try it. Um, hopefully it's not too horrible. Because um, I don't really like bloody gory stuff. So, although I did just read The Monstromologist, which was kind of bloody and gory, but I kind of looked around all that and the story itself was really, really, really good. Um, this was one. Uh, completely different genre. This is from the romance genre, How to Eat a Cupcake uh, by Meg Donahue. This one was suggested by uh, Debs at uh, Deborah's Book Cafe. And she liked this book, and of course, I like cupcakes, so I'm going to try this one. Uh, this was one that Krista from the Cubicle Blindness sent me. It's an arc of Masters of the Veil. Um, by, I don't have my reading glasses on right now, it's by Daniel A. Cohen. And uh, I wanted to actually get the ebook of this, but they didn't publish it in, um, in this, for the, for the Sony ebook reader. So um, she decided, was very nicely, sent me the ARC since she has read it. Um, so that's just, I just wanted to go over those uh, th three books. I have gotten lots, lots 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 more since my last video I think I don't remember when that was or my last book haul so I don't I don't think I'm going to be going through all of those and dragging them all out um, I thought about it but then it would just go on forever and ever and ever because there's like over probably a hundred books that I've gotten in the last um, since my last book haul I guess three months ago or so so anyway, I hope everybody's doing good, and um, I hope to see some people maybe doing the Deweys. And if you are, um, let me know in the comments below, and maybe I'll see you there. Bye.